Jason Siegel yeah. with Harrison Ford, where he's a shrink, but he like ends up, you know, as far as storyline that I've seen, goes through like a crisis and then just ends up shooting all his patients straight. Pretty much just being like, hey, your husband's a piece of shit. You need to leave your husband. Like no longer walking on eggshells and mm-hmm. just being one of those straight to the point therapists. Mm-hmm. And, you know, for, for people like us that, that suffer from, you know, mental depression, anxiety or whatever, that's what we like hearing in the first place. So yeah. to me, I think this is going to be one of the, my, like my wild cards this year, but I also expect this to be a really good show because I, I think the cast looks, looks great. And I'd love to see the perspective of someone like that, just literally just telling all their patients, Hey, I'm not just going to sugarcoat this for you. Like what you pay me for. This yeah. is what you need to do in your real life. You need to quit your job. You need to quit the, you know, you need to divorce mm-hmm. this guy, this, that, and the other. So I see you guys kind of shaking your head a little bit. I see a little bit of excitement here. I'd love to get some feedback on this. So w- my best friend is like huge, like she's pop culture nut. And so mm-hmm. um, she was like, Shrinking will be the new series that connects with the Ted Lasso fans in terms of like that same like, Kind, like you know just delving into like the reality of life and like taking it head on and also like just being real with each other about everything that's happening you know what I mean so I she's like super pumped about it I'd never heard about it before till she told me about it last weekend and I was like I'm in because I would love someone to just be like uh this is a shitty situation get yourself out of it instead of me being like this is okay and they're like I don't know. <laughs> yeah i i think uh, from what i've read about it today it, it looks great i think in general i'll just make this statement i think apple tv is about to have a fucking monster year great. because i was going down the lists like in variety and time and all that like the new shows to watch this year and it would be like apple tv apple tv apple tv like they've got a lot coming and their marketing, like the Timothy Chow May thing, that commercial on the heels of what they did with John Hamm last year is yeah, yeah. I fucking love it. And it's like I'm not commercial guy, but when that comes on, like I watch it because number one, who doesn't love Timothy Chow May? Who doesn't love John Hamm? But just like the idea of like, you know, why don't I have a documentary? Like, why, <laughs> you know, like, like call me, you know, like Apple TV call, like, it's just great. And I, I think Apple's really set to explode. Netflix is hurting right now. Right. Like I think Hulu's got its, got its place. It's niche, but it's more like live TV. They do their own stuff. It's more like live TV that they're showing the episodes the next day. Disney's got its niche with its own, like original content. Like I think Apple TV, TV can can take that space that Netflix held for many years with like just across the board good television movies um I feel like Apple's going to going to going to make a move this year on, on Netflix I really do 